Today, we're going to discuss course careers and careers, which one is better, pros and cons of both, and stay to the end because the last reason why I chose course careers is actually going to surprise you. Changing careers and pivoting into a non-technical tech role, I'm sure you've heard of these two names, course careers and careerist. These names continue to float around, and I'm sure you're wondering which one you want to go with. Today, we're going to break down course careers and careerist and why I chose course careers. Reason number one, of course, is going to be the cost. Course careers is $4.99 without a discount code, $4.50 with the $50 discount code. Careerist for the sales engineer role is $4,200. Now, when I was pivoting, that was not something I wanted to pay and I wasn't willing to sign up for any course that was going to take any of my earnings once I got the role. I know that there are a lot of courses out there that do that. So me choosing course careers meant that I paid the one-time investment. For me, it felt like a shot in the dark. And if I hit, great. If not, that 450 was not going to cause me to go bankrupt. Number two is the level of position you get after the course. So course careers promoted entry-level roles that didn't seem like it would be too challenging to get. Uh, the information is free online. You could Google it. You could go on free YouTube channels, but the time that it would take to compile all that data, study it and organize it in a you know, concise way, as well as make sure you're studying the most important and relevant information is just way too time consuming. With careerist, I noticed that the roles were more middle level and I just didn't feel confident that a course was going to really help me get a sales engineer or middle level role. Unbeknownst to me, that is exactly what happened with course careers as well. And many people have replicated that success. So it is possible. I just wasn't sure how probable it was at the time. For me, number three was going to be reviews. So of course, after that, I started looking at reviews. I noticed that there were quite a few reviews on Careerist and how great it was, but there was an overwhelming amount of bad reviews. Once I checked LinkedIn, I started seeing people that got hired. It seemed like more people were getting hired through Course Careers than Careerist, and it also seemed like that 450 was going to go a lot longer than the $4,200 went for those that took careerist. Uh, reason number four for me was going to be that it was self-paced. So course careers allows you to go at your own pace. I've seen people finish in two weeks, three weeks, four weeks, one month, two months, three months, four months, really just depends on the individual. And it's very seldom that I see a person that is consistent, diligent, studies the material, really has a good grasp and understanding, and they just don't find a job. Um, typically, I see course career students get hired very regularly, even to this day. With careerists, there were set times that you had to meet, and these would be group meetings where you would be taught more like instructor-led sessions, and it just wasn't something that would work for me at the time. I was already in school. I was already taking so many classes. I wanted something that gave me the flexibility where if I felt like you know, I had too much on my plate, I could just slow down or stop. And if I had less on my plate, I could actually do more work. So I wanted something that was going to be self-paced and course careers did that for me. The last and most surprising reason was the community. The Course Careers community is a family and everyone is so willing to help. Um, I reached out to so many previous students that were able to pour into me and there were even students that came before me that were willing to take the time to drill with me, do role plays with me, even help me with my interview process. They would do interview prep with me. They would ask me questions along the way to make sure I was understanding and retaining the material. And we were just helping each other. Um, at the time we met in the Discord twice a week and we would be on there for 30 minutes the co-founder would come in there we would practice together we would go over cold calling we would go over discovery and different questions you could ask and it really felt like I was a part of this new thing this new family that was just really helping change things for others so I really enjoyed that I also found that with course careers, 
It seems like people come from all different walks of life. There were people who have been janitors, HR managers, healthcare, literally every profession um, was they were able to come through course careers. They were able to get a job. They were able to learn what they needed to learn. And not only were they able to get a job, they were able to get jobs at reputable companies. Even the company that I work for, a few of the students came before me, they were hired, and not only did they stay in tech sales, but they also went over to customer success. And I thought that was really cool. So I reached out to a few of them. I just really felt like Course Careers got it right. And it was something that I wasn't seeing in the other courses, especially not in Careerist. And this is not a knock at Careerist by any means. I have not taken it. I don't know what it's like to be a Careerist student. I just have heard several horror stories and I just wanted to shed some light on why I chose Course Careers over Careerist because it was something that I battled with prior to finding out about Course Careers. For anyone who has taken course careers or careerists, please comment down below what your experience was like. I'd love to keep the conversation going. Um, and if you have taken a boot camp and you are struggling to find a job or you're not sure how to get resume help, watch this video. It's going to really open your mind and help you see things from a different perspective. That's all I have for you guys today, and I will see you in the next one. And please always remember you're smarter, stronger, and much more powerful than you give yourself self-credit for. And if no one's told you today, you're doing a great job. Keep up the good work. Give yourself a pat on the back and don't forget to count your blessings.